So uh, one experiment I'm thinking of making uh, with a minimal amount of money investment is a jib on grace. Tie a block up uh, through the masthead, run a halyard through that, and make a temporary jib out of this sheet. Put some grommets in it, and uh, that'll actually be a pattern if I want to order a real jib. The reason for doing that is a little bit less weather helm on Grace. The um, rig is it's called a cat boat rig where the mast is fairly far forward and gaff rigged. And so the center of effort for that sail is pretty far back and I you know if I if I I kind of wondered if it would do that. I could have moved the dagger board aft a little bit, anticipating this. An alternative that I've considered, um, although I already have a nice sail and it, it's not cheap, not in a hurry to buy a new sail, but you can also go with something called a sprit sail, where the, basically there's still a gaff, so you keep the shorter mast. But uh, you basically bring that gaff almost perpendicular, and then you get more of the traditional uh, modern uh, Marconi rig type sail, and the center of effort would be moved forward, and I'm sure that would take care of it. But in the meantime, by putting a jib, there's not much room, but I could let it overhang the mast a little bit. By putting a jib up, I think it would uh, it helps efficiency wise to come close to the wind just like a double slotted flap on an airplane it seems to be slightly more efficient uh, and it would help to move the center of effort forward a bit and balance the helm it, the, the only real issue with a lot of weather helm is it's slightly inefficient you're sort of dragging the rudder through the water more than you need to so we'll see how that goes all right, so this is the forward end, or no, this is the aft end with the halyard coming back to the gaff. So we want to figure out how to mount a block that would sit from the masthead forward for a jib halyard. There's a lot of ways that you could mount a block for a halyard. You can have a strap screwed on with a fitting and then the bolt, the block on that. I hate to have anything that makes the mast any harder to move around on the boat without scratching stuff. One simple thing, and I can simulate it with just in a test mode here, would be to have a strap that holds a block. So let's see if we can get a lashing that just kind of positions this block near the masthead without having to put hardware in here or cut anything. Yeah, I think that'll work. An 8 by 10 rectangle. Test halyard. Put the sail up and see what that looks like. One of the questions is how far do you dare overlap the main? You get more sail area obviously, but it's likelihood that it'll hang up on attack and if you're really getting smacked by a gust that can be bad. I'm happy with how that looks at the masthead though. I think that's very doable. Probably the best place for a pair of jib cleats out of the way would be right in here. Try to sail with it, I think, on light airs anyway, and just see, see what that does. Interesting. This would be the tack. Already a grommet. 
at the head, make the hole. Well, such as it is, there I think is a test jib. Tack, clue, nastily two-pieced, and halyard. I think I'm gonna test sail my test jib. Rigged uh, some very basic versions of some jib, at least blocks. No cleat, obviously, but that may be for the best. Let go of it and we're done. This would be the jib sheet. I'm nervous about this. Experiment. Jib halyard. Dacron wouldn't be as sticky. So, how much less weather helm is there? It's kind of a key. It's really hard to say. I think there's some less. the verdict mixed. <laughs> Probably help uh, the, with the washout on the gaff. You get it to stall less quickly around the lower part of the sail so you can bring it in tighter to the wind, come closer to the wind. I don't know if I call it a failure. I'm not sure I'd call it a success. Maybe I'll get some advice from the Duckworks guy. Here's the jib. I bought uh, these two guys, and I guess what are called bullseyes. They work really well. Second set of blocks 
and a cleat. Move the main over to that side and use this one for the jib. It was on this bracket. I had the sense that uh, actually Dacron would be more slippery and I should have made it a bigger sail, but live and learn. goes raising the jib first and ultra tightening it. Where if you're going to pop the sheet, the jib goes first. This tiny jib, you need to pop the main first. And then an attack. I think it can help. Bring the bow around. Which has been difficult. All that center of effort aft. Flying both sets of telltales. I'm liking that. I think there's less weather helm. Certainly no trouble tacking. That feels really good there. Feels like it's just moving through the water more efficiently. Nice day. Let's try to jive with the jib. Can I run wing and wing? There we go. Absolutely no problem bringing that sail across the mast, and it's still a good rowboat. 